But Tim Smith, the man leading the charge for Virginia Moonshine, is a world away, taking the fight to a different front. My dad, even though he's not living, he would be proud right now to say, wow, my son went to Poland and he took a bottle of our moonshine that we created in the woods, you know. That, that is like super. His shine's fame has given him an unprecedented opportunity. Friendly Polish people. The chance to bring American white whiskey to the European continent. Can you believe I'm in Poland? I mean, no, this is an international trade show I'm going to here. I mean, this, this is like the, the biggest thing in, in, in the world, and I can bring my climate moonshine here. Look at all these people. All these people want moonshine. They just don't know. Europeans consume more alcohol than any other population on Earth, and the prize territory is still virtually untapped by American shine producers. I'm on a mission to, to get an international contract so I can get a distributor, because legally I cannot sell in Europe. If I can get one country to accept it, then all of the countries in Europe surrounding that country is gonna say, yes, we want some too. It's a domino effect. If Tim can get the jump on the corporate brands and secure a European distribution contract, he and Belmont farm owner Chuck will have the funds to finish Tim's new Virginia distillery. But he only has 48 hours. Okay. I'm fitting in just right. I'm going to be polishing. It's rough road, huh? It's cold. So we've got these people right here. We've got to have moonshine to warm them up. I know they're going to like it. <laughs> 